I've been racing for 15 years and I've been driving top fuel hydro for 13 of them. This is my 13th season. Oh, wow. I got into drag boat racing with my family. Uh, my dad started racing back when I was about six, five, six years old. And I tried with him on weekends. We started off with our family boat in the bracket classes and then worked our way up steadily. I try to race with the excitement. I mean, uh, there, there's not too much better out here in what's going on, you know? It's, it's what I do, it's what I grew up doing. But last year on uh, first round of top fuel racing in San Angelo, showdown in San Angelo, I crashed the black Mac Mav TV boat out here. Most everybody's gonna remember it out here. It was uh, very first pass of the week in the top fuel, she launched out. She came out good and she just got upset and then over she went. And I think I started crashing the half track and it finally finished it up, tumbling through lights at 180 miles an hour in my capsule. He now has a new boat ready to win the showdown in San Angelo. He raced for the first time in the new ride last week. The, the, the best way to describe what it's like to go racing out there is that you've, if you've flown in a, a, a jumbo jet is one description, okay? You feel that time when she starts to climb, that's what it is. Now take that by about 10. Now Scott is back with a brand new boat, hoping to conquer the liquid quarter mile in San Angelo this year.